for a company that develops an energy efficient technology, it is very important to speak with the people who understand the market and the industry very well and can pre provide an, a qualified appraisal of what you do. My company Vert Rotors designs and makes the smallest rotary conical compressors. They are very powerful and they are used in space and robotic and medical applications. They uh, produce very little noise and very little vibration, but they are more energy efficient than reciprocating compressors of a similar size, which means they need less electricity to run and produce less CO2 emissions. Uh, back in 2013, when I started the company, I wanted to commercialize the technology of conical compressors that we developed. But very soon I realized that the journey would be much harder because having a disruptive technology we had to prove to everyone that it worked so well. So uh, ECCI uh, helped us along the journey in many ways but uh, first, first of all supporting us and introducing to the key people uh, in the industry that gave us a bit of advice or knowledge or even join the company. At that point of time uh, when we started to work with ECCI and their support was really fundamental to the business because they opened a few doors to us that really helped us to first improve the technology and secondly improve the corporate governance. First uh, ECCI introduced us uh, to City University of London who are a think tank in the compressor industry not only in the UK but also in Europe and they helped us to characterize the technology and pick up the, f the most beneficial features that were so important to our success. Secondly, uh, ECCI introduced us to a, a, well, a professor but also a very successful businessman who started his own company back in the days and uh, successfully sold it and uh, he he's retired now but he has all the knowledge from uh, this compressor startup business and then of course this knowledge was so so important for us in the future i see our company becoming a, a major supplier in the aerospace and robotic sectors uh, we see that those sectors grow dramatically and uh, we want to be a part of this growth and of course uh, we will need more uh, access to the knowledge uh, to uh, academic uh, academics in the in this in this uh, sector uh, from Edinburgh University and from other universities around the country and also test centers because when uh, you're dealing with a new technology it's very difficult to predict what other materials you may use or what other fabrication process you may use the next day uh, to solve a very particular technical challenge and therefore this a support uh, will be quite critical for the company you know, looking into the future.